Holy crap, guys, this is happening. This is not a joke. Tesla is already shipping Model Ys with hardware 4 built inside as of today. Now, as expected, it wasn't going to take long before Tesla starts to ramp up production of the hardware 4 cameras, and it was going to make its way onto the Model 3s and Model Ys. Now, I know I've been telling you guys for the past couple months just to wait out a little bit longer, a little bit longer, but honestly, if you weren't even interested in full self driving or hardware 4, it wouldn't have made a big difference anyways but for those of you that really care about future proofing your vehicles and keeping your vehicles for more than 10 years this is what you're waiting for so a twitter user by the name of zach you guys probably heard of him on twitter he goes by the handle black model 3 now he just recently tweeted out an update of what he saw inside of a parkade and this was the new model wise with the new cameras and hardware 4 now this wasn't him just searching for hardware 4 model wise this was him just casually strolling along and he noticed that there were cameras with the red tints inside and if you guys don't know what the red tints even mean if you guys check back that some of the newer model s's and x's that just got released they do have this red tint and this is supposedly going to be the new ira filter or the sun filter but what it's going to do is just block out the glare and give you a more quality image whereas hardware 4 you wouldn't see so much of this red tint although we don't have any confirmation if this tint really actually does anything we're all just speculating right now a lot of people are even saying that this is an R filter that's able to see through darkness so you don't get those indications on the screen any longer of saying that the camera is blocked anyways just getting back on topic here so he saw these vehicles in the lot he went up to them saw the red dots and all these vehicles are going to be delivered in the near future so they're all awaiting delivery process right now he did take a couple quick snaps of all these cameras and they look very familiar to the model S's and X's. Now you're probably asking, how do we know for sure that these Model Ys have hardware 4? It can't just be simply the tint. Well, if you take a look at the image right here of the front mounted housing cameras, you'll notice that there is also that dummy camera to the left of it. Only the hardware 4 units here will have a dummy camera. If you go up to your own personal car that has hardware 3, you'll see three different sensors there that are all usable. Now, if you guys are watching this video right now and you have a delivery coming up, I'd 100% recommend that you guys hold off and just deny that delivery altogether and just wait for the next VIN to come out because that vehicle is likely going to come off the line with these new cameras. Now, as far as when these vehicles will be delivered, we don't know for sure yet, but I'm expecting within the week or two weeks just because they're already sitting there waiting the delivery process. Now, one thing that probably crosses our mind too is if these vehicles are going to have the new HD Phoenix radar that we do see in the model S's and X's. I know those vehicles are the highest trim and highest models, so they might have additional features, but I think with Tesla trying to streamline all the processes of the autopilot package, they're probably going to add these new radars in there as well. But we won't know for sure until somebody gets delivery of these vehicles and rips off their bumper and see if that radar is in there. But hopefully we get to see soon enough with the Tesla community being this active, somebody is bound to take off their bumper after receiving these new hardware for vehicles and letting us know if there is a radar or not. So I'm going to keep this video as short and simple as possible as I gather more information and if anything else comes up regarding these hardware for units, I will let you guys know first. So make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, that bell notification, and this should be it for this one. But I will be making another video on a more detailed look at these vehicles. So stay tuned for that as well. Guys, this is it. This is John once again. Peace out.